Severe weather concerns for today include a thunderstorm threat in the Ohio Valley, some intense heat that will be impacting portions of the southwest, plus we'll take a look at the situation down in the tropics where we may have some activity in the coming days. But we begin in Louisville, Kentucky, where it is a sunny, hot, and muggy start to the day, and that warmth is setting the stage for some thunderstorm development later in the day today. As a cold front comes sliding southward into the Ohio Valley, thunderstorms are likely, especially in these orange-shaded areas where we have an enhanced risk for severe weather, damaging wind, large hail, certainly a possibility, but thunderstorms are possible anywhere along that frontal boundary in those dark green shaded areas extending from the northeast through the central plains. So here's how that looks on the forecast. Very warm and muggy in the southeast and the Ohio Valley out ahead of this front that comes sliding southward, generating storms throughout the evening and afternoon hours uh, from the northeast all the way through the central plains. Across the west, there's no wet weather in sight to bring relief from the heat, and it is certainly getting hot. High temperature records may be in jeopardy today. A projected high of 122 degrees in Needles, California, would break the previous record of 119 degrees. Phoenix also may tie their previous record on that day, uh, and Las Vegas may also tie their previous record uh, today. And, of course, uh, with that heat, the National Weather Service has a number of excessive heat warnings as well as heat advisories in place across the region. We'll continue now down to the tropics, where we're keeping an eye on Tropical Depression 4, Max sustained winds at about 30 miles per hour, still sitting well to the east of the Caribbean islands. Right now, the projected track has it moving north of the Caribbean islands, maintaining its status as a tropical depression, not likely to become a hurricane, but that is something that we're going to be continuing to watch in the coming days and a potential impact on the Bahamas. Continue to check back here for your latest severe weather updates.